The parents of the 39 kidnapped students of the Federal College of Forestry in Kaduna State have appealed to both federal and Kaduna State government to rescue their children. They accuse the government of being insensitive to their pains. The parents, clad in black, holding various placards with inscriptions like, Bring back our students. Bring back our children. We cannot sleep without our children. Their lives matter to us. End banditry. Insecurity in Kaduna must end now. Bring them safe, among other chants. Addressing journalists at the school premises, their spokesperson, Friday Sani, says government should do everything possible within their reach to secure the release of their children, bring them back safe and alive. He says they no longer have any piece of information from government and school management on their effort on the release of the children. Why is it that bandit kidnap people in the state and is now telling us that he cannot negotiate with bandit? We will continue to remain and occupy these roads of yes. Kaduna State yes. until yes. our students are brought back to us. If they don't have anything to do, if they don't have a way to negotiate, they should tell us who are they talking with so that we'll come out and negotiate with. That's what we want. They should help us because all of us, we are widows. We don't have anybody. We don't have money to, to release our children. They should help us. The parents also called on all stakeholders, human rights organizations, NGOs, the MBA to rise together in one voice to prevail on the authorities to ensure the speedy rescue of the Afaka 39 students. It is now 12 marriage days since the unfortunate incident happened and we parents have not received any positive message from either the school management, Minister of Environment, under whose ministry the school is, or the Kaduna State Government under whose territorial jurisdiction the school is located. We have therefore called for this press conference to call the attention of government of, at the state and federal level and all stakeholders involved and indeed the world to act with dispatch to ensure the immediate and safe release of our children. Recall that on the 11th of March 2021, gunmen invaded the Federal College of Forestry mechanization and forcefully abducted 39 students of the institution at gunpoint, 23 female, 16 male students. Several others sustained varying degrees of injuries while running for their dear lives. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.